Taoiseach and Minister of Government. Uh, last night, uh, the Mayor of Killarney, Councillor Niall Kelleher, and myself met with a number of Ukrainian refugees and stakeholders from the community in Killarney in relation to the outrageous proposal to relocate 135 Ukrainian refugee, refugees, mainly women and children, from Killarney to Westport in County Mayo with 48 hours' notice. These people have been living in Killarney for the last seven months, have put down roots, the children have started school, the women are working in local businesses, they've been set up with their local GPs, and now with 48 hours' notice, they're being uprooted and being sent to Mayo. This is completely unacceptable, and I am calling Minister on you to make the proper decision here. This is not humane. And if we are treating this uh, emergency as a humanitarian response, there has to be humanity at the, at the centre of this. I'm asking for you to look at the alternative accommodation to think, Killarney, if these people must be moved and avoid this appalling, appalling situation that is facing these people. Thanks, uh, thanks, Deputy. And look, I, I recognise that the move of these 112 Ukrainians will have an impact on, on families and on individuals. And the reason for the move is the pressure right now on the state's measures to meet the accommodation needs of Ukrainian displaced persons and international protection applicants. The numbers of Ukrainians arriving in the country have doubled in the last month, a consequence of the renewed attacks on, on civilian targets. I, international protection applicant numbers remain high and we continue to have a real difficulty in sourcing accommodation for international protection applicants. We've already had a situation where because of that lack of accommodation for international protection applicants, we have to turn international protection applicants away for a number of days. And it's to try and avoid situations like that recurring that we have to take up all available accommodation for international protection where we can locate it. And this is the, 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 the case in Killarney. And I know asking people to move it will have an impact on them. I absolutely accept that. But fundamentally, my department has to be in the position to provide accommodation and to provide meals for all applicants, Ukrainian and international protection applicants alike. And that's what we're seeking to do.